Legend of Total War here with part 3 of my Dawn of War Dark Crusade Let's Play campaign as uh, the Necrons. Alright, so previously we've um, we finished off the uh, the Imperial Guard and we've started making our way towards the the Space Marine uh, encampment. But uh, we're at the end turn now, so let's just go ahead with that. Oh, we can't actually attack them from here. There's a wall blocking it off. Alright, so this region here is very safe. Well, that's good. So I guess let's move here firstly. So we have a choice. We can finish off the Space Marines or move into Tower Territory. I would like to take out the Space Marines. However, I think this is one of the more difficult ones to take on. But we're only playing on normal difficulty and the Necron Lord has proven himself very powerful. And we're starting to get the hang of it a little bit. So I think we can I think we can pull it off. And if I fail, well, I'll just try again another time. The Space Marines of the Blood Ravens chapter were well entrenched in their castellum in North Vandia when they finally faced an all-out attack. Utterly unwilling to surrender or retreat any further, the Blood Ravens prepared a mighty defense against the coming assault. Among those defending the keep were Space Marines drawn from the chapter's hallowed first company. These were the hardened veterans of many crusades, each man ready and able to face down whole squads of enemy attackers. The Blood Ravens on the ground would be further bolstered by fresh troops arriving from the battle barge Litany of Fury in orbit around the planet. Only two factors made the Blood Ravens at all assailable in their stronghold. Most critically, the fortress was unable to receive reinforcements directly from orbit. Captain Thule thus had to establish a forward base to receive drop pods and landing craft. Although well defended, this base could be taken. Secondly, the Space Marines had established their base near ancient ruins, which the Ravens claimed held relics of great importance to the chapter. Unwilling to desecrate the space by fortifying it, Fuel opened the door to an enemy claiming the area and thus dealing a powerful blow to the normally unbreakable space marine morale. The Battle of North Vandia would be one of the bloodiest of the entire war. The enemy is at our doorstep and thinks he can push us off this world. He is already gloating. He can taste his victory. But what he fails to see is that we will make this his last meal. The Chief Librarian has ordered the Purge of this world to protect our chapter's secrets. Are we to retreat with our duty unfulfilled? Are we to let a black mark stain the banner of the Blood Ravens? I say that. I say our enemies will regret the day they ever decided to face us in battle. Our battle barge orbits overhead and will rain the Emperor's holy fury upon our opponents. More of our brothers will come to join the fight. But as ever our enemy outnumbers us, each of you must be an army in your own right. Veterans of the First Company, the finest of the entire chapter, stand with us. Let their valor guide your fire into the enemy's heart. Remember that we are Blood Ravens, brothers. We have all sworn to protect fonts of hidden knowledge. Each one of us must fall before handing this word to the enemy. The Emperor is with us. The Unknown Primarch is with us. They have come for our blood, but they will drown in their own. Alright, so first thing we're gonna do is get the energy 
We are the Emperor's finest. We will not fall to you, alien. Your end is inevitable. We're gonna need some soldiers Submit right off the bat. Spare yourselves the pain of living. Because we're likely to come under attack almost immediately. Mm. Just thinking maybe. Maybe I should get some more Builder Scarabs. Having just one isn't really good enough. So, because it's a, uh, like a final mission, sort of, for the, um, for the Blood Ravens, it's not about gaining territory as quickly as possible, it's sort of about hunkering down. At least at the start. seem to have this wave under control. There's a great thing about these guys here. They don't use up any of the squad captain. He handled that like a champ. Gotta stay close to the base for the time being. So these here will provide a decent spot to defend from, because these can fire back. They're just sending spies in, it's not a big deal, I worry about it too much. Use a summoning core now. Upgrade these so they can actually fire back. Build a scar um, not uh, scar two, two spiders around here. Because they were quite useful when we were assaulting the um, the uh, Imperial Guards fortress. Capture temple ruins, capture the orbital relay. Okay, the orbital relay is not too far away. So let's start sending just cheap squads to go and fight them. When I say cheap, I mean completely free. As always, we need to make sure we have plenty of energy. Alright, 
right, so... How do we get there? We've got a reasonable amount of uh, energy coming in, but we do need more. Necrons are very powerful. For them to be able to take on space marines like that. So you gotta go all the way around over here to get there. Just, it doesn't even matter if these get killed. Easily replaced. Okay. Another monolith, I think it'd be a good idea. If we get a hold of that relic, we can we can have the awakened monoliths, and we've seen how powerful those are. If I send him, you know what, I'm going to send him off to combat because I can always just, he's so easy to, and cheap to revive. Even if he constantly dies, it keeps them very busy. Tactical and assault squads, resume the attack! Okay, I've almost got enough for the third one. I think it's always a good idea to get three for these kind of missions. So we just need, I guess, a little bit of time to generate some more energy. Okay, we get some good energy coming in at the moment. Cut off Space Marine reinforcements from here, okay. See, while he's holding them down, we're able to keep building, because they they can't kill him that quickly. And he only costs 175 to revive. And of course, while it's going on, I'm generating a lot more uh, energy. We've got to keep going with it. Use this. Gives the Necron with the uh, yeah. thousand times of currencies. Greatly reduce the amount of range damage, so that'll help against Space Marines. And then there's Lightning Field, which is useful as well. Then I want the Revive Orb. Okay, he died. Alright, send in the next wave of. Crap. 
Don't have any braids, but still. Let's get it anyway. Just send them on suicide missions because they don't cost any money. You go back into the fight and just kill whatever you can. Get over to here. So he's not the best at dealing with machines, but if we can get him to be the uh, that Grim Reaper type thing, that'll sort him out. Not in desperate need for more soldiers. Gotta tech up quickly. Okay, we've got a really good amount of energy, but I think we could use a little bit more. So I think we can now justify bring in reinforcements. We've got good amounts of energy. Keep them well reinforced. You go and help them. These guys here, they just protect the base. For the time being. If we need to have a big push, we can send them in. But they cost me requisition on the campaign map, and we don't get a whole lot of that just yet. Alright, he's about to die again. Even with all this energy, we still spend a lot of it. But soon we're going to get to a point of critical mass where we just couldn't possibly spend it all. Tomb spiders. Difficult position to assault because of um, gonna go all the way around. They get to shoot us the entire time. But likely these guys are so tanky. For the chapter, they should just be able to keep reviving them. You go in and help. I don't do a whole lot of damage to that. Hold the relay station. We must keep in touch with the litany of fury. What's going on? Just keep bringing in more troops. Okay, there's the resurrection. All good. We can use that. Probably 
to remove their own men. this, see if we can get ourselves some more squads. <laughs> We've got a sizable squad going on here. We're breaking their defenses, and then we make our way to the orbital relay. So like I said, let's get three Tomb Spiders. Why can't I get another one? Oh, I've already got one here. Once again, it doesn't really matter if he, he gets killed. So it's holding up pretty well. They're running out of defenses, motherfuckers. This is no owner. Alright, so I have to get some scarabs over there. Can we just attack it? I guess we could set up like a forward base of operations. Well, there's a defensive position here. Over here, use the resurrection order. Got more squads than before. And these guys just sneakily go through. He's, he's really getting very powerful.
we, we don't need to worry about energy now. We're all, that's all under control. Shall deliver it unto you. So we gotta cut off their reinforcements from here next. So this place here is definitely gonna need gorse cannons. Okay, so we can call in orbital bombardments now. That's funny. More than one. The enemy is trying to cut off our reinforcements. Drive them back. Seems like we only get the one. I don't know. Yeah, it seems like we only get the one. Oh well. Oh shit. I'm sure this can handle it. Otherwise these guys are coming in help. I think three here should do it. Oh, sorry, I don't need to build it within the sphere of influence. Oh no, I can keep keep doing this. I just thought it would have like a recharge time. It just wasn't sure what the recharge time is. Man, these guys are strong. They haven't lost a single one of them yet. This is pretty easy to take. Looks like we got all this under control. I mean, the Imperial Guard were putting up a much bigger fight than this. Okay, I think that's that's pretty well fortified. As well. Not that we really need the energy. Uh, cut off Space Marine reinforcements, great. So we should be getting less pressure from them. But we know that, you know, assaulting this area here is just going to require a ridiculous number of soldiers to, to take. Thermoplasma generator. I don't really need any more energy, so I won't bother putting anything on this one. Next stop, we go take on this uh, relic. Let's make sure we've cleared this area first. What should we do 
now. Yeah, I, I need to be able to see what I'm doing in order to shoot that. So there's still a few more buildings out this way, but I won't really worry about it too much. I think it's more important we just aim for the... or whatever. If they want to go for it, well maybe we can't go down that way. Could use this, but this is not essential. Save it for something important. Alright, you. I want you to come over here and if you can make it there without any defenses, without any support, then build a slag deposit here. Thermoplasma generator. Just so the enemy don't get them. Not that. I think they pretty much get unlimited resources, they just hold on to it so you can't get it. But like I said, we don't need it. So if we have a look at our objectives, capture the temple ruins. All right. I'm pretty sure we, we kind of need to do all of that stuff. I mean, we can go straight towards it, but it gets increasingly more difficult the fewer of the secondary objectives we don't do. Okay, next thing we gotta get, I think. Oh, don't tell me you're stuck. Oh my god, they're stuck. Um, okay. This sucks, because... Okay, we shouldn't train anything from here, then. I actually need to demolish a few of these buildings. I'll just build them elsewhere. Okay, now they can move. get heavy destroyers, good for vehicles. The Scarabs might actually make it. Okay, now, as for these guys, they're control group 2, we want them to Collect corpses. The blood ravens will not fall to one such as you. And I only collect Necron corpses. It seems. There's quite a few over here. These guys will also join with Control Group 1. And they'll be my anti-tank um, anti support. Now, you, I want you to come over here where there's loads and loads of corpses. There should be. And go and collect them. We need to build some... Ghost Towers here, we want to defend this. What energy does that provide? 30. It's better than nothing. See, these are, these are starting to decay. Another reason why you want to build loads of them, because they do decay over time, and you really want to set them up at the beginning, so you get, get the resources the entire time, not build them progressively as you go. use this because it's pretty good against buildings. And 
seems to be pretty much immortal. Every time he takes a or dishes out damage, he regenerates health as like a vampire. It's a good way for him to heal. Just use this and then generate health. I mean, it doesn't doesn't last him long enough to get to full health, but better than nothing. Man, they're still working on this. These guys will go. These two will go join with Control Group One. And assist in the fighting. So I think this one here should be the revived monolith. If we revive this one, oh, it could please teleport, teleport past it. So that should be fine then. Whirlwind shooting. to make our attack on their uh, their sacred temple. They're over, let them go. Don't need them. Their temple we're after. Okay, that looks pretty well defended. They're still constructing this. Yeah, because each one, they, they take longer and longer to build. But it's fine. We've, we've got enough energy to get us through the rest of this. I mean, most of these soldiers don't even cost us any energy. It's really just the destroyers. Enemies are near the chapel, brothers! Close ranks and attack! Where is their artillery? That's what I want you to go do with. Keep them distracted. Get the buildings. What's going on? Is he stuck or something? I didn't get used anyway. I don't know what's going on there, I seem to bug out. Oh, what am I doing? I've got this. 
forget about it sometimes. Eh. Not really very helpful. You guys need to traverse the field, come over here and capture this road. Alright, you finish that one, you can go ahead and build another one. I really don't usually worry too much about the mines, they eventually just run out of mines and you know, sitting there trying to get rid of them can be a bit of a time waster, especially when all the units are basically free. Send these guys up into battle. Oh shit. Good, we're pretty much at max strength. We'll go here. Seems like we might need to build another, like, summoning core or something, so that we can increase our vehicle cap, because it's stuck on 12. Is it this that provides more? Not so. Or maybe I need to actually capture more, more points. I don't know. Good. This was so much easier than the Imperial Guard. The Imperial Guard were tough. We will drive you from their Necrons. You will only follow your Emperor into death. The Emperor protects us. We will not fail. You will. You won't fail. Yes, you will. No, we won't. Alright, let's keep going. Oh shit, man. But it is just a tough move. Ok, 
Okay, it'll take you quite some time to get there. You won't get there unless you get started now. Yeah, see, we increased our um. It seems like we need the summoning claw, so I'll build another one. Gotta get them destroyers. Good for taking out buildings and tanks. It's gonna take you absolutely forever to get there, but let's get on with it. Finish. Bring them over here to repair it. Really good at getting them all together than using the lightning, that sorts them out. This fight isn't over yet. But your life is. Yeah, this fight's over. There's got a few buildings over here, but I'm, I'm not concerned about that. That's not part of the objective, don't worry about it. No. The other summoning core didn't do anything. I think it's I think it's actually the uh, you gotta capture relics and things like that. Or capture points more. Like She's a little in the wrong spot. I thought he was over here. They might actually take the spot back. Doesn't matter. Well, they're desperate to take that back. We're going to finish the mission. Destroy this and then it's over. It took us less than an hour to do this one. The other mission took us like two hours, so half the time. I think there was just less to do. Like the other one that the uh, 
Imperial Guard just had so many little mini objectives you have to do. The artillery was such a pain. No honor to be had in defeat, but someone must deliver the targeting beacon. Orbital control, lock onto this beacon and fire. Full power. Even the elite of the Blood Ravens could not hold back the murderous advance of the Necrons. The Necrons answered the Space Marines' shouted benedictions with stoic silence and murderous blasts from their goss flares. The aliens were uninterested in any arcane secrets that might have been hidden in North Vandia, utterly ignoring the scorched ruins of the Blood Raven's chapel there. Their gruesome warriors flensed the flesh from every space marine left on the planet, but left their holy battle armors and other relics to corrode in the harsh weather. Tragically, among the flesh reduced to particulate ash was the gene seed of those space marines, dealing a near fatal blow to the chapter. By taking North Vandia, the Necrons defeated the Blood Ravens on Cronus. But by purging the genetic heritage of all those fallen battle brothers, they may well have destroyed the whole chapter. All right, good. So we got two new war gears and space marine done. All right, so what do you need? Increased melee damage and morale loss. That's pretty significant damage. What else is there? Range damage. I don't worry too much about range damage for him. The extra 200 health is not that much. And Heart of Darkness, increased health regeneration. I'm thinking the skinning and reaping blades would be best. So they can kill faster. And that's the end of this turn for us. Okay, so we've got a good amount of requisition. What shall we do? Who's, who's our next target? What do you think is our, our capital is completely wide open at the moment? But no, none of the lords are even close by. I don't think the orcs have moved at all. Alright, so... I'd have to take on the Tau general here as well, but their defences here aren't very good. I'm thinking let's take out the Eldar, but we have to go through the tower first to get there. So they've got a bit in their honor guard. These guys remind me of the lizard men. Um, actually, I'm just thinking maybe maybe you best bypass them because they they can actually put up a blow of a fight. Let's go back over here and then attack them here because this this base port will let me essentially to move around wherever I want. But it's well defended. For much of the Dark Crusade, great fleets plied the orbital lanes above the battlefields of Cronus, using their firepower to ground long-range flights. Don't have time to listen to every single one of them. Go around. And kill everything that you can find while we set up base over here.
thing is, we've got to find out where they are. That's the hard part. This is a fairly big map. Small maps are easy. You just go and find them and kill them. That's a um, that's a servitor. It's a space marine. We've got rid of them. The scarabs are analyzing the human hybrid, but we require more of them. The I don't have anyone here right have now. recovered a servitor. Do not let them savor their petty victory. Requires summoning corp. So you just sit there and tank this for the time being until you get over here. Not let them get away. This isn't really a great start if they're attacking a base. But it's it's a pretty weak force. It should be okay. And we're attacking their base as well. Maybe it would be a good idea to get a summoning core so I can bring some of the guys back. There we go. Slow them down. He's pretty much single-handedly destroying the entire base. Hang on, hang on. You go, you go back over there, you gotta help them. Stay together. Get a uh, critical location. Oh, there's some well, strategic locations. Send these guys off to go fight somewhere. We'll be fine. Still need more energy. Take out their buildings, because they're just constructing new, new buildings. Build it faster than we can destroy it. The living have recovered a servitor. Do not let them savor their petty victory. 
What does it matter? Find and recover six servitors. Hmm. So at least they've shown us where their base is. Yeah. They may actually get to six before us at this rate. Ah, they're uh, infiltrated. Oh well. Base here is cleared out. Let's keep going. That moment is a crude melting of flesh and metal, but yeah, it contains with us. valuable information. Bring it to the monolith. They keep getting sent back. It doesn't matter right now. We're just going to destroy their base. Don't worry about that. Covered a servitor. Do not let them savor their petty victory. All right, still need more energy, and a greater summoning core would help. the human hybrid but we require more of them look at they've been shooting us the entire time and they can't even kill one well, that one's about to go the living have recovered a servitor let them see further. So, you got reinforcements coming because these guys here are getting wrecked. So we can actually bring in reinforcements faster with two. That's for me. Why can't I get more? Oh, they revived. Gotta find their base and destroy it. I'm gonna stop their reinforcements from coming. Okay, I could use more strategic locations. The living have recovered a servitor. Do not let them savor their petty victory. Our enemies have recovered most of the servitors. We must gather more quickly. I'm moving as fast as I can. The scarabs are analyzing the human hybrid, but we require more of them. So we've got three, they've got five. I'm not really prioritizing with the servitors that much. These two guys here taking on the enemy base single handedly. Oh, alright, so, um, well, there's a relic up here. Hopefully, we can capture that. Hopefully, they haven't fortified every goddamn position. Looks like there's a base up this way. How do I get rid of the infiltrated units? I suppose a wraith would be able to do that. 
takes infiltrated units. Right. Yeah, I think these two here are I met their match. They're just a bit too uh, outpowered here. Damn it. Alright, we'll let this one. Try to find their base and destroy it. I gotta, gotta find the fucking place, that's the problem. Let's put the ghost turret here. That way it's good. Right, clear this off here. I don't think there's anything here. Well, if it's all cleared out, at least we know that this is basically their, their last base. Possibly, I don't know. The Necron Lord can handle it pretty much on his own. So damn strong now. Okay, we can still get one more monolith. Why not? Okay, we gotta make our way up here. So I'm fairly sure, I mean, we haven't checked this area here, but I don't know, I somewhat don't think it's there. I'm about to build this shit. Okay, that's cleared away, good. Out of the relic. Try to take away their uh, their face. Um, tomb spiders sounds like a good idea. Let's get them going. That's why I'm waiting for these guys to catch up. Move into their base, because all we have to do is take out their base and then that's it. Don't even worry about the servitors. I think the race got yeah, the race got destroyed, but that's okay. Let's make another one. Hurry up. There's not much left. What are you doing? Come up through this way here. Our enemies have recovered most of the servitors. We must gather more quickly. Oh, they're trying to build on that, I see. Well, they're not doing very much damage to us. Where's, where's the wraith going? There. Get over here and protect the ship for us. Suppose we'll really need a lot of wraiths when it comes down to um, dealing with the Eldar. Can't you walk up? I guess they can't walk up there. But you can teleport. Right, now we need an, uh, an energy core so we can become that great thing. That's gonna get destroyed. Unless you come over here and repair it. A good find. Okay, 
I'm lucky we might just be able to save that. Good, that relic's cleared. And these guys will rendezvous about here to take out the enemy base. points. I don't need the points, but it's just about taking it away from them. You're strong. It will be good to have that strength. Okay, now we need to start getting destroyers. Still need more power, do we? Alright. Well, we'll work towards that. Take out their buildings. That's what we really need to be doing. Slow down their rate of recruiting troops. Corpses over here, go go get them. Brought him back to full health as well. I didn't manage to repair this yet. I think if we destroy that, it'll be game over. Weakness of the uh, Necrons is they are very slow. Yeah, good one. Maybe we have to get rid of their like build and joint things. But that should have really weakened them. Okay, just go clear this away for me. You can see they're attacking us a lot less frequently now. They actually had a Do base there. Do not let them savor their petty victory. Our enemies have recovered most of the servitors. We must gather more quickly. There's only two more that haven't been claimed. Apparently. Claim in these points just to prevent them from it, obviously. Alright, well, this area here is cleared. Now we just need to find them. They might have a base in here somewhere. 
Well, they could have built somewhere where they've. You know, kind of... Like town, we have prospered. The spaceport is ours. Oh, are you fucking kidding? That's stupid. <laughs> you don't get it unless you. Fuck me. I was moving as fast as I bloody well could on that one. I should have at least destroyed their defenses there though, so it should be a lot easier for us next time. Alright, so I did I thought it just like nah, that's crap. Alright, so we have to basically go do that again. Alright, so I didn't realise that was gonna end the mission if I didn't get all the servitors. I have to move faster. I, I think I've lost my honor guard, but I've got heaps of requisition so I can get it back. I didn't lose all my my honor guard, just some of it. Enemy has two large bases. So we just have basically have to start again. Of the Dark Crusade. Great fleets plied the orbital lane. Alright, gotta move faster this time. At least I know roughly where they are. Their biggest base is up here. Shut the fuck up. Go up there. Shut up, dog. For fuck's sake, what's going on? Might be a good idea to actually start claiming strategic locations earlier this time. Because they're good at defending positions. There's a server sort. Let's claim that before they do. That human is a crude melding of flesh and metal. But it contains valuable information. Bring it to the monolith. That's too. That gives us a little bit of a hit. Are analyzing the human hybrid, but we require more of them. Here and defend the base. The scarabs are analyzing the human hybrid, but we require more of them. So we've got two. That human is a crude melding of flesh and metal, but it contains three valuable now. information. Bring it to the monolith. Summoning court, right? If you grab that. Get in there, help. I think get one of these already. So many have we got? This is two. We need to hurry up, get over here. The living have recovered a servitor. Do not this, let them fuck me, these, these battles being wrecking me over here. God damn it. Supposed to get rid of that. It's, we're like a minute into the fucking battle. All right, well, I, got, I don't know if racing gonna be any good now. Need more energy. I guess maybe building a gorse turret. I think that might help. Finished, good. I want you to go and come down over here. Get this point. Jesus fucking Christ, these guys are being relentless this time. 
It's way faster than the last time. Covered a servitor. Do not let them see further petty victories. Christ. This was a really hard mission. The human this is no time to set up. We require more right, I'm gonna need another monolith. I just need to recruit troops faster. The scarabs are analyzing the human hybrid. But we require the monolith required for that. Them. At least we've you know got some defenses here. You just keep keep them coming. Guys over here are at full strength. We've destroyed one of their well almost destroyed their base. The problem though is this motherfucker. How the hell is that fair to get one of those this early on? I've got no anti-tank stuff. This is units of free. It might benefit him to have the, uh, let's see, the infiltration. Which one's that? Setting stabilizers. Oh, I don't know. This. I know it's kind of annoying that not only do they set off with such a huge base, but there's this stupid get all the stupid servitors missions, which I'm not going to fucking guide all these, these wankers to the base. I don't have the resources to do that. I'll just get their brief things from their base. Alright, so I need more energy. So we've only got plus 50 because I've had to defend the fucking base from this thing. Hopefully, this is the only one they're going to send at us for a little while. If we prepare this. So they managed to defend that base, that's good. Come on, let's... We know they've still got more stuff over here. Where are my other fucking scarabs? Okay, you... Get over here and capture that problem. Okay, so you're getting wrecked. Okay, there's not as many, many things here this time. God damn it, I cannot move fast enough to stop them moving as fast as I fucking can. Their infiltrated damn units are everywhere. Take this. What we've got here, we've got to go for their base. Got to find out where they're hiding their servitors and go and destroy them. It seemed to me like it was over there. What the fuck is these infiltrated units? I just don't have much to, to get rid of them. I know that I'm supposed to get rates, but they've had these infiltrated units from the start. The energy. Where's the oh, hand? Get from here. See, if they get three more, it's game over, regardless of, you know, base, uh, base destroying mechanics. Fuck off. You should just get, get over there, just go straight there. That's where their bases go straight there. I need another model. Oh, I don't have any energy. Okay, um, need more energy then. That human is a crude melding of flesh and metal, but it contains valuable information. Okay, well, at least Bring it to if we the take it, they can't take it, I suppose. Like I 
set up, but I'm just not concerned about doing it that way. Better to prevent our enemies from gaining it than trying to magically find where the other fucking three would be. Back in such a messy way. Where's where's the wraith? The scarabs are analyzing the human hybrid, but we require more of them. I think they killed it. I just it's hard to keep track of everything. Gotta move so damn fast. Take that down. Okay, I need another monolith. I can afford that now. I think we just need to just fucking move it. You gotta move so quickly. Gotta get over here and destroy this other base. Alright, alright, alright. Right, we still need more energy. So this would have been very difficult on hard difficulty. I probably just would have had to have fought this later. Would have had more honor guard. At least, at least these things don't do much DPS. We just got to keep keep it in them wherever we can. Okay, well, there's a servitor. But human is a crude melding of flesh and metal, but it contains valuable information. Bring it to the model. I'm just gonna find where their goddamn base is. They cannot keep destroying everything everywhere. I don't care. Keep killing. Okay, there's a wraith. Um, send them over here. I thought that's where their base was, but it's not. Teleport over here. Okay, at least they've only got three. I think we've slowed them down a lot. I think because they came at us so aggressively at the start, there's another one. But I almost don't even want to go for it. Because that, that could walk straight into the enemy base. I'm not going to escort flesh us. And metal, but it contains valuable information. Bring it to the model. Yeah, got this pressure put on us now. What if it's over here? What if their base is right in here? Seems like usually wherever there's like a triangle of things. That human is a crude melting of flesh and metal, but it contains valuable information. Oh, here we go. Found a base. Bring it to the monolith. And here's another base. Good. We found we found their three bases. Okay. Don't, don't even worry the about it. Better just to kill them. Hybrid, but we we've got more than this time. Okay, so we Seems like we've got this under control. Even though it seemed like at the beginning we did a really shit start. Seems like we win this flesh time. And metal, but it contains valuable information. Bring it to the model The human hybrid. Well, we've got five. We that's more than we got last time. So that's good. I'm feeling a lot less pressure now. The living have recovered a servitor. Do not let them savor their petty victory. So start building up the bases so that at least if we have to defend this place, we're at least a little bit more built up. And we found their, their service force, so we can steal them away from them. The 
That human is a crude melding of flesh and metal, but it contains valuable information. Bring it to the monolith. We've got it this time. It's an absolute clusterfuck, this mission, but we got it. Not only will we get all the servitors, pretty much, but we've destroyed all their bases. Carry on. But human is a crude melting of flesh and metal, but it contains valuable information. Bring it to the monolith. Now we need greater summoning core. Cool. We, we have all stuff. we need. Our purge continues unabated. I got eight of them. I didn't like that mission at all. That wasn't fun. But it's done. We got the spaceport. Second try. That's pretty good. Anyway, we're at an hour and a half, so it's a good place to end the episode. So guys, like and subscribe, part four is next, and don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.